OBS can run on just about anything but if you're one of those unlucky people who got the GPU not supported error, you're in the right place. My name is Yadullah, you're watching Gandero Technology and let's fix your problem. So trying to do an OBS screen record and you suddenly get hit with a GPU not supported error. Uh, thankfully this is very easy to fix. The first thing that you have to do is head over to Windows settings and I'm just going to switch over the scene come back here and i'm going to search for graphic settings so this will open up your display if you scroll down you will see a section called graphics you're going to click on that and now you will land on this page what we're going to do is we're going to find obs in this list which is right here as you can see and it is set to high performance if i click on this and then click on options you can see that I have a couple of options here. I can either let Windows decide, I can set it to power savings in which case it's using my integrated GPU and then I can set it to high performance in which case it uses the dedicated GPU inside my PC. What you have to do is that you have to set OBS to use your dedicated graphics card in which case uh, just select it to be high performance, click save and uh, then restart OBS. That's it. You're good to go. If you don't see OBS in this list, however, you can uh, scroll all the way up and then come here custom options for apps uh, and then you can have either a desktop app or a microsoft store app i want a desktop app and then click browse and then you can just find the obs executable wherever you've stored it click ok and bring it back in If that doesn't fix your problem, one thing that you can do is try and look for a GPU driver updates. Now, depending on whether you have Intel or AMD, you're going to have to use the specific utility. For example, I'm using uh, an NVIDIA GPU. So I will be using GeForce Experience to update my graphics card driver. We'll just let it open. Uh, head over to this driver tab right here. And then as you can see, I have an update available you can uh, use this button to check for updates as well but if you have any pending updates go ahead and download them and uh, they it shouldn't take a very long time but once you've downloaded and made sure that your drivers are up to date then try restarting obs and do this once again finally if nothing else works and we don't recommend doing this you can try downloading DXCPL. Uh, this software essentially allows you to emulate DirectX 11 and launch games on a PC with a very old video card. So if you have a GPU that isn't supported in OBS at the moment, you can use DXCPL and then use it with OBS. Although I don't see a reason why you would have to do this considering if you're using Windows 11 where the problem actually happens, you would already need to have a GPU that would be able to support OBS but in any case if you feel uh, that you have a really old video card and you can't get it to run you can use DXCPL to emulate it once again I don't recommend it if you have uh, not been able to fix the problem comment down below and uh, we'll see what we can do about that if you like these videos consider subscribing give us a thumbs up press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below if we were able to help you out if you'd like to know more about tech, visit our website, candid.technology, follow us on social media, follow me on Instagram or Twitter, and we will see you in the next video.